Hi, welcome to another Wild Wednesday from Wildlife Ambassadors. We're coming to you here from our farm. I'm Becky Shore, Director of Wildlife Ambassadors. And today, our spotlight is on June, a Virginia possum. June is a really unique animal to our area because she's the only marsupial we have in all of North America. So what that means is that this cute girl, when she was born, was literally the size of a bumblebee. Marsupials are not born fully formed, and so they climb up into their mother's pouch where they actually do the rest of their growing. So they're really amazing. We uh, only have this one. Obviously, we know about kangaroos and wallabies, but they're not native to North America. June's a rescue that came to us. Um, she was saved when her mom was hit by a car, but unfortunately, due to improper feeding as a baby, she has uh, metabolic bone disease. So she has some trouble climbing and can't be released to the wild. Possum are great backyard neighbors. Um, I talked about this with the skunk, that having these guys in your backyard is actually beneficial. Uh, They're not pests, even though sometimes people consider these guys vermin. They're very, very far from that. What can she do? Well, just like our skunk friend that we met before, June the possum is able to eat venomous snakes. So they're very helpful in that. They're immune to the venom. But the other thing that people really like to hear about these guys is that these guys can eat thousands of ticks every single year. Obviously in an area where we deal with Lyme on a very big basis, this is great news. So she's a really, really good animal. One of the fun things about possum that most people ask about or know about is do possum play dead? They do, and we even call it playing possum because these guys pretty much coined that phrase. When they get really frightened, they will do a very good job. They'll roll over on their side, eyes closed, mouth open, tongue hangs out, they'll even drool and make themselves smell bad. A very, very good display that most animals will then leave them alone when they see this. You can also probably see I'm gently holding on to June's tail. It's almost like a handle. You certainly could do not do this with any other kind of animal, not a dog or a cat, we never would. But in a possum's tail, it's muscular. And it's a really cool tail because it is prehensile. So what that means is that it works a lot like your hand does. When June climbs, she can use it uh, as an extra appendage to help her climbing in the trees. But she can also use that wonderful tail to help her gather leaves and things in the fall to get ready for winter. So if you see these awesome guys out at night, be happy that they're hanging out in your backyard because they are doing you a great service, both with ticks, rodents, and then also a uh, really good control of venomous snakes. Join us next week for another Wild Wednesday.